Hey guys, welcome back to Full Time FM, where we're playing Liverpool, and I forgot to press the record button. Um, <laughs> so I've been talking to myself for five minutes, picking the team. Uh, luckily, just as the teams were getting announced, I remembered. Uh, so Van der Voort's in goal, Kenny, Tadibo, Almeida, and Hickey across the back. We're going to play Tenali in a DM role. Barkley and Matt Domine in midfield with Edwards and Almada cutting inside and helping a razor up front. Um, Liverpool. Still got Alisson in goal. Uh, Alexander Arnold. Opemakeno, Van Dijk and Robertson. That's a hell of a defence. They got Isco in midfield. There's some guy called Ugarte and Keita. They got Zaniolo playing behind Mane and Firmino, so they look like a bit of a uh, bit of a strong team, to be honest. Um, gonna praise the boys because right Anfield, Armada, oh, back of the net, top corner. Thiago Armada's took a free kick and whizzed it in the top corner. Let's have a look at this. That's some distance. Oh. Alison couldn't do anything about that. In off the post. Here's this go with a corner. Oh, what a save by Van der Voort. From Van Dyke's header. Liverpool are pressing really high there, aren't they? Oh no, man, hey, oi. Oh, tries to uh, chip Van der Voort. I wasn't sure why Van der Voort was putting the ball back down again then. Oh, he could give it away to Zaniolo. That Tomine's on him. Oh, Firmino's got in there. That's Hickey's fault, that. The left back. Bloody Nora. Bloody Nora, son. I got Frimpong, but... Huh. Time to focus. Sort your head out, pal. Hmm, you didn't like being told to focus. Right. I'm going to stay positive in the dressing room. Tell them we're happy with them. 1-1. One, one against Liverpool. Not a bad result. But it's only half time. We can do better. Okay. They're down our left hand side again. Isco cuts in. Van der Voort's there to pick that one up. Is that not offside, Zaniolo? Oh, Van der Voort saves it anyway. So they're playing from the back. Here's this go. Good tackle by Tonali. This go coming forward again. Mane takes it off him, gives it to Alexander Arnold. He plays. Oh, what a save by Van der Voort from Mane. Don't like the way this is going. Van der Voort, super keeper. I think what we're going to have to do, it looks like they're getting stuck in, you know. Um, last the assistant. Make some changes. There we go. I think I'm going to bring Adam Lozak on right hand side. And I think Harizo's not doing great up front, is he? Hmm. Oh, good tackle, Hickey. Almada comes away with it. Oh, what's he doing? Boys. Oh, 
Uh, I think I'm going to have to take Hickey off for uh, Jeremy Frimpong. Oh, McTominay. Sets a razo through. Come on, lad. Oh! A Pemakeno with a good tackle. Do we go for the win? Oh, can he miss that? There's Jones. Oh, good tackle there. And Tadebo clears it. Right. I always go for the win. But a draw against Liverpool was quite sensible. But I think I'm going to... I think I'm going to go for the win. So, Adam Lozak on the right. Almada on the left. Rafa Mir. If Rafa Mir can go up front... Um, so we've got a Rezo and Mer, and we'll just push Tonali up and we'll go with a 424. Lozette can be an inside forward that attacks. Rafa Mer can be a complete. Complete forward or advanced forward that attacks. And Arezo can be a complete forward. Or even a pressing forward. Right, I think that's us going for the win. I think we have to go for the win. It's the way we play. There we go, it's Frimpong to Mer, who's just come on. Oh, he's at the post. Tago Armada tackled by Alexander Arnold. There's Mane coming away with it. Almeida comes across and gets it. I'm going to try and praise the boys. Armada puts one in. Here's Ross Barkley to Nally. It's tackled by Alexander Arnold. Counter attacks on here. It's three against two. Zaniolo's giving it to Jesus. Oh, Van der Voort with a good save. When did they get Gabriel Jesus? <laughs> Ball goes uh, in the box and headed out. Jones picks it up. Plays it down the line for Ugarte. A few minutes left of injury time. We are going for it. I'm quite proud of the fact we're going for it. Showing a bit of bottle. Oh, 1-1. One, one. There we go. Van der Voort gets a 9 out of 10, by the way. What a job. Uh, what a good job he's done. Um, Arezo, I think, let us down a bit there, but... We'll be alright. Um, there we go. Lads are happy. 1-1. One, one. Away to Liverpool. It's not bad. I don't actually fear them now. I mean, they've got some good players. Uh, Leila Khan says, what a result. Can't believe it. I'm absolutely buzzing. Um, Xander Turner says, just got back from the match. Did not see that coming. What a result. Orhan Erdem says, any young aspiring goalkeeper out there should watch Martin van der Voort's performance today. He was superb and he can learn a lot from his display. There you go. There you go. So, it's a creditable draw, I'm going to say. Very creditable. And we're still going to sit top of the group, which is good. 822 grand for a draw. Youthful Celtic draw with Liverpool. There you go. Van der Voort impresses. 16 saves. Wow. Only one conceded. There you go. What a dude. My 
Ty Cerezo off a new contract. Okay. 120 grand. Mate. What are you on right now? I was on 64. I'll suffer him 95. Um, minimum fee release clause. No, you're not having one of them. Uh, a big contract but at least we're keeping him that's the main thing five-year deal okay guys so we're going to be playing with Van der Voort in goal Kenny Tadebo Ampadu and Hickey across the back um, oh they got Hannibal maybe in midfield with Rangers and Alvaro Fernandez who looks like a goal playing left back um, let's see one of the corners of the ground seems to have filled in. That's good. Uh, we've got Jorginho and McTominay in midfield with Thiago Armada playing behind Matthias Arezzo. Both teams playing a 4-2-3-1. There's uh, Jorginho. Stabs the ball through the hickey. Oh, saved there by the keeper. Arezzo. Oh, Almada, sorry, puts that in. Richards goes after it. Oh, why has he ran that out of play? <sighs> Touch like a baby elephant. Uh, you'll be glad to know I've actually sorted out the throw-ins, the corners, the free kicks. Um, usually I just let the players do what they want to do. But I thought, you know, we're playing Rangers. Um, we've got to play some European games. So I'll just I'll sort that out, you know. Um, normally I'm an absolute bugger for it. I don't do it at all, and I should do. So we've got key highlights. And here's Ryan Kent putting it in. Ampadu with a header away. Georgino's after that. He's leading a counter attack. He's got a man in front of him. It's Arezo. He's through one on one. Oh, back of the net. Why has Rangers got a free kick? Oh, it's offside. Oh. Georgino released it too late. O'Reilly there. Being closely marked, Fernandez running down the left hand side. Edwards tracks back really well. And uh, oh, what a ball that is to Almeida from Edwards. Almeida cuts inside, runs between two defenders. O'Reilly gets back and tackles him. Van der Voort, sweeper keeper, he is playing as a sweeper, as Ampadu. Taribo out on the right hand side to Edwards. Oh, he's had a dip and just missed. Hit the stanchion behind the goal. Lasso Muir is the goalkeeper for Rangers. Never heard of him. O'Reilly gets past Hickey. Gets to the byline. Ampadu with a great tackle. Why is O'Reilly stopping? He's never getting a free kick for that. Thiago Armada takes it away from a couple of players. Running through the middle here. Lays it off to Edwards. Oh, he's tackled by Fernandez. Arezo lays it to Armada. Oh. Just wide. Good counter-attack in there. And uh, boys doing quite well. McTominay's picked up his obligatory yellow card. There's Arezo. What's he going to do? Tries to cross. Roberts blocks. He plays it down the line for Kent before clearing it. And Ampadu gives it the hickey. Plays it inside to Giorgino. Forward for Richards. Arezo. Loose ball there. He's string some passes together. Ampadu pushing the ball forward. Is McTominay to Georgino. He's got a little bit of space. Can't find Edwards. He oh, Rezo shoots wide. Ooh, we are threatening, that's for sure. And uh, top of the table clash this is because Rangers are picking up some points this year. 
So Ryan Kent. Can't believe he's still at Rangers. Oh, Ennis Unal. The striker. Great save by Van der Voort. Tadebo should have been on him there. Kent puts this one in. Headed out by Max Tomney. Leads it back to Aberdeen. Or 11th. Three points from nine games. Dear me. Oh, Georgino's picked up an injury. Well, we have Ross Barkley who can come on for him. Um, I think Ross Barkley, he wants to play as an attacking midfielder who supports. Well, you have to be an attacking playmaker that supports, mate. Does he want that number 10 role? He does, he wants that role Rico Richards is in. Mm. Well, half time. Right. Uh, I'm going to be positive, tell them I'm delighted with them. They all looked inspired and motivated. That's good. So there's Hickey with the throw into Richards. Hickey coming forward. Stabs it through to Richards. Is he going to shoot? No, he passes for Edwards. It's now cleared by Gomez. Might be John Joe Kenny taking this throw in. Can't believe Georgino's injured. He's just come back from injury. But when you can bring in Ross Barkley and you've still got Sandro Tonali in the squad. That is why we're ready for Europe. We've got Giorgino, McTominay, Tonali and Barkley. Here's Ryan Kent to Hannibal. We've got Roberts on the right on the overlap. Don't let him in the box. Oh, he's giving away a penalty. It's Hickey again, isn't it? You prat. Come on, Van der Voort. Oh, he saved it. Oh, and Kenny clears. Gets Hickey out of some trouble there. Stay on because I'm not happy with that. Um, McTominay. He's not doing fantastic in midfield, is he? Oh. Um... Still nil nil, it's a tight game. Ryan Kent again. Oh no. Oh, get it out. Taylor finally clears it. Right, hang on. Oh. Heinrichs for Rangers. Gives it to Kent. Gets stuck in him. McTominay's there. Taylor clears it. And everything goes through Kent. Ah, well wide. Right. Demand more. Brian Keady says. So. I'm looking now. We've got one sub left. we got Zachary Oka. Murr. Roker. Marcelina Kelleher. I'm thinking... McTominay is not looking all that fit. So maybe if we just move Richards into central midfield and we bring perhaps Roker on that right wing for Scott McTominay. Um, and we'll play Marcus Richards as a Mazella that attacks. Okay, and we got Roker as a winger that attacks. 
there you go, it's attacking, we're going for it, last 15 minutes, let's see what happens, Van der Voort's having a cracking game, 7.8, he got a 9 out of 10 against uh, Liverpool, John Joe Kenny, at right back, plays it left footed up the field towards Roku, cuts inside straight away, running at Rangers, comes for Barkley, Gives it Almada. Edwards, get in. Marcus Edwards in that Mazzella role. Go on, son. Oh, my God. Let's be balanced. Roker with the run right there. And Edwards, who followed that space that just opened up in between him. Nice little slipped in ball by Almada. 1-0. Come on, lads. So, we're going to be balanced. Edwards looks knackered though, doesn't he? Um, Richards, sorry. Richards looks knackered. Here's Roker again. Ball's cleared out. Oh, Ennis, you know. Lays it off to Kent. Come on. Oh, Van der Voort with an easy save. Right. Calm down. The entire team. Just calm down. Right, in possession. Time wasting, always. Confirm changes. <laughs> right, last few minutes of injury time. We'll just take the pace out of the game. Boom! 1 0 against Rangers. Oh, Martin van der Voort's 8.4 he got. That's pretty good. Um, Edwards got a 7.8 got the winner well done lad very nice victory well done boys there we go oh wow just back from the match did not see that coming what a result unbelievable result let's really build some momentum now bravo van der Voort. although the less said about your teammates inability to add to the scoreline the better Tom Povey come on bro Jeez. So, we are nine games in. Um, 26 points. Uh, sorry, 25 points, but plus 26 goal difference. Rangers, nine games in. Plus 18 goal difference, 22 points. So that puts a little separation between us, which is always good. Injury worry, worry for Georgino. Oh, six to seven weeks with a broken toe. Christ, we've already got Marcos Paolo injured. Sports only here for another two weeks. Nabil Faker, we've had to deregister because two to five weeks until he's fit. Georgino is now five to seven. Uh, so we've lost Georgino and Faker till New Year. Uh, Charlie McCann, just a day. Ben Wiley, two to five days. So we've been hit by a few injuries from, you know, to. Big players had two big signings, really. Georgino and Faker, you know. And Marcos Paolo as well. All three of them will be starting, I think. So we're going to praise Van der Voort. Well done, son. That's not too bad, really. 1-1 one, one against Liverpool. And um, beating Rangers 1-0. It's always good. 12 matches in a row without losing. We did draw. I'm sure. Yeah, we drew with Kilmarnock 3-3. And we drew with St. Mirren 2-2. Uh, let's have a look at the schedule. There you go. So we're doing all right. We're doing bits. Um, we beat Aberdeen in the Betfred Cup quarterfinal to reach the semis. Semis. Sorry, semi. Bloody hell. It's an old American Yoda now. Uh, we play Benfica next. Um, and I think I might make it a Benfica double header and then a Fenerbahce Liverpool um, episode as well. So make sure you stay tuned because that after those games, maybe Friday's episode will take us into January, the transfer window. So <laughs> we'll see how we do. Thanks very much for watching. Make sure you subscribe, hit the like button. I will see you all in the next one. Take care of yourself.